Hello and welcome to my peak week pet files. I am now two days out of show so I just wanted to show you a little bit about what I've been doing this week. After my show I will post my next two days leading up to the show and also show day. So just want to say a huge, huge thank you to everybody who has watched me on this journey and been with me through the good times and the bad times and everything else. It has been a journey like no other. I am so excited that the day is nearly here. Um, this week has been full of people wishing me luck and buying me presents and buying me food to eat afterwards. So I am just so thankful to have the people around me that I've got. I have obviously had my nails, my brows done and my lashes, so we are nearly ready to go. Thank you again and enjoy this week and I will post a new video after the show is done. Today on check-in, John gave me some oats and some protein, so I'm just having that as a little snack with some zero-calorie sauce, which is going to do me the world of good, I think. So excited to eat these. This afternoon, I decided to make some wraps with lettuce leaves, and like it's okay, but it's definitely not a wrap. Four more days of eating like a rabbit. And then it's carbo. Okay, and I've just got home from work. It is my last COVID testing session until my show. I've got three days in work until my show day, but I won't be COVID testing, which is great. And I am looking after my mum's dog, Dave. And last night we had lots of chills. Um, he sat on the couch next to me and just relaxed. So I'm going to do the same again today. We have dropped cardio completely this week. My training has been massively reduced, so we're just going to be doing a calorie deficit workout. So that's just really low weights, high reps, just to give you muscles a good pump, but not strain them out too much. And we have stopped training legs now. And the only thing I've got to do on top of that is 8,000 steps. So... I've got a lot of time on my hands today, which is absolutely amazing. Got some beautiful flowers and a good luck card off one of my longest standing friends, Meg. And it's all starting to feel super real now. So I have just received my peak week protocol and it is feeling extremely real right now. So I've got everything about my water, the food that I'm eating, and then this at the bottom has literally made me cry um i could not have done this without the guys from the fitness faction and i'm so thankful to have had their support throughout this so be right back just crying it's wednesday morning and i cannot believe that we are so close to show day now i woke up and we have the timings for the show and they've sent over the link for the pay-per-view. So I've sent that out to my friends and family. And yeah, I'm just feeling so excited now. I can't actually believe that we're here. Um, it all feels a little bit surreal at the moment. I'm really, really tired this week, although my cardio has been cut and my steps have been cut. I think my body has just realised that I've stopped. So it's just hit me like a ton of bricks. But um, yeah, oh my God, we're four days away. Ah! getting my lashes and my brows done my friend emma has done them and they look amazing i feel almost human and it's so exciting my colleagues have also got me some things some easter eggs and some prosecco and some really lovely words inside a card and my manager has got me a um, Starbucks card which is great because I absolutely love Starbucks and a little card so 
Thank you guys so much. It's Thursday night and I have three more sleeps until show day. I am currently getting my steps in, in the rain. I am so excited now. I can't believe that all of this work is nearly over. It's nearly show day. I am a little bit nervous, but mainly excited. Yeah, just super excited to be at the end of this amazing journey. So excited for tomorrow, getting my nails done. I'm gonna do my normal food shop and I'm gonna be filling my face full of carbs and I can't wait. I am so excited to be cooking my last piece of salmon on prep. I do not want to cook another piece of salmon for at least a month. Goodbye, salmon. It's Thursday night and I'm just heading to bed and I am so excited. I also today went to the toilet 32 times to go for a wee. So my water loading is definitely my first carb meal of the day, which is 50 grams of oats. And I've mixed that with some sweetener, some um, oat milk, and also some low fat chocolate sauce. So half a banana and 20 grams of peanut butter. I am so excited to eat this because I've not had a banana in 18 weeks. I'm going to pick up a cake box ready for Sunday when I finish my show for my little local bakery it's called The Sweet Creation in Chorley. Super looking forward to stuffing my face with that on Sunday when I get home. Meal two of carb loading day. So I have 60 grams of chicken with some hot sauce on and five salt and vinegar rice cakes. I've been and had my nails done for show day. So I just went something nude and a bit sparkly, but it's not me at all. I never wear nails because I play the guitar. So feeling really feminine right now and also got some Glittery toes going on. Lots of brownies have just arrived from my mum and Keith. And um, it is from the Northern Treat Box. So I'm going to take these with me on show day and I have them when I get off stage. My wonderful friend Heather bought me this. And it's a little key ring with my initial and a weight and a little dumbbell. And a little sign that says strong is beautiful. So I'm going to take that with me as a bit of a good luck charm this weekend. I've been to do my post-show shot, which is super exciting. Actual milk and cream and ice cream and cheese and fruit and tomatoes. I've missed tomatoes so much. And bread. Yep, super excited to eat lots of this and bacon and sausages. And I've also got a treat drawer, which is just ridiculous. And I'll this show you that. This drawer has been in my house for the basically the whole time in prep um and i've been picking things up as i've been going when i've been seeing them and it's biscuits and chocolates and um things like that and everybody's amazed that i've actually been able to have these things in my house and not eat any of them but excited to indulge in some of those when i finish three we have one american bagel with 15 grams of strawberry jam and a pop tart my friend Molly has got me this mirror, which is amazing because it's going to help me do my makeup on show day. So she is wonderful and I'm super thankful that she has got me one of these so I can make sure that my makeup looks tip top for show day. I'm just in the process of packing my bag for the weekend. So we have my overnight bag, which includes some extra bedding for the hotel so that once I've had my tan done, I don't stain the sheets. I've got some baggy pyjamas, which I'll pop on to go to sleep in. My flip-flops when I've done my tan. I've also got some extremely baggy clothes to put on when I've done my tan. And a extremely dark towel. I've got my makeup and my straighteners. My mirror. Some things to help me sleep. So some candles and some sleep spray. Um, and then I've got my hair stuff. My toothpaste, toothbrush, charger, and some baby wipes. I also have, which is going in my day bag, is a shiwi. So 
once you've had your tan done, you have to be really careful not to get toilet marks on your bottom when you sit down and also to make sure that you don't have any dribbles. So I've had to practice weighing with a shiwi to make sure that I can do that without any dribbles. So that will be coming with me. Some people choose to use plastic cups, but I went with that option. And then in my actual bag, we have my shoes. Um, which look like this. We have my backup shoes in case anything is to happen with these shoes. These shoes are the ones that they prefer, but obviously if something dreadful is to happen, like my heel to break, I like to have a backup pair. I've got my ID, my hand mirror, some Haribo, which I'll have when I'm backstage. I've got more face wipes. I've got my membership login. I've got a sewing kit in case of any emergencies some mouthwash, my cables so I can get a bit of a pump before I go on stage, my robe, in there is my bikini and in here is all of my jewellery that I'll be wearing. So I'm just going to pop all of this into a bag and get ready to set off tomorrow. I'm out doing my last lot of steps on prep. The sun is out and I'm feeling fantastic. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> Second to last meal of the day, I have got 50 grams of ground rice, 25 grams of protein and some peanut butter. I've whacked it in the microwave with a little bit of baking powder and made a little cake, um, which is uh, really delicious and um super looking forward to eating this right now. So I have been checking in with John basically after every meal today and he doesn't think I'm full enough so we are having some chicken and rice now with some hot sauce on and then I am going to get a double cheeseburger from McDonald's before bed. Tomorrow we will check in in the morning and I'll do a check in before bed and hopefully that will look really good. I cannot believe that I have had another delivery of alcohol, cheese, bread, a beautiful card and some locally made um, desserts and cookies and blondies from my best friend Becca, her husband and the little girls. So, oh, I'm just literally overwhelmed by everybody's support. It's so nice. And I'm just so thankful for everybody that's around me right now. I am just back from McDonald's and I'm finishing my double cheeseburger. I'm then going to send some pictures to John and head to bed. First day of carb loading done. We are heading out tomorrow and John will be with me the whole time to check my carbs and make sure that he's happy, put in what he needs and just check that everything is going right and in our direction. And that is a wrap. So I will be posting a video when I have done my competition, when the day is done when everything is finished and I have officially been on stage so for now that is me over and out and I will hopefully have some really positive stories to tell you about my weekend um, when I post my video next week so thank you so much and I will see you soon